fearful of a Russian invasion into Ukraine, the U.S. and NATO allies are ramping up efforts for a diplomatic solution. Today, France will hold a high-level meeting aiming to ease tensions between the two countries. But President Biden warning the 8,500 U.S. troops on standby to Europe may be deployed sooner than later. We have no intention of putting American forces or NATO forces in Ukraine. But uh, we, I, as I said, there are going to be serious economic consequences if he moves. The president also warning the U.S. may personally sanction Russia's President Vladimir Putin himself if Russia invades, on top of other severe economic trade sanctions. If he were to move in with all those forces, it would be the largest invasion since World War II. It would change the world. The administration now stepping up military support for Ukraine. Our Ian panel is on the ground as more American anti-tank and bunker-busting missiles arrive in Kiev. This is the latest delivery of U.S.-supplied weapons and ammunition to the Ukrainian government. It's meant to send a signal of support to the people of Ukraine, but also a message of deterrence to the Kremlin. The acting U.S. ambassador to Ukraine confirming that support. The Ukrainians are ready and capable of defending their country. Uh, and we will be there to help them. And we don't think that Ukraine should have to live with a loaded gun to its head. But the Kremlin insisting they won't attack, even as more than 100,000 troops are gathered near the border. These new images show the Russian military conducting drills across the region. The U.S. is finalizing plans to help Europe with natural gas should Russia cut off supply amid current tensions. President Biden will hold talks with Qatar on Monday in an effort to send some of that nation's vast supply of gas to Europe. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.